Hello, my name is Martin and this is 3D Printing Iceland. Today I'm going to show you two uh, results of the print samples from the Maker Box. I have a high temperature polycarbonate ABS only alloy from Protopasta and uh, Polymax PLA from Polymaker. So let's have a look after the intro. So first off, I'm going to look at the high temperature polycarbonate ABS alloy from Protopasta. This filament printed rather easily for a ABS uh, based filament and uh, I didn't have any special issues with it. I tried uh, a flat print uh, to check if it was having any warping issues and it did have some warping issues but uh, uh, it was okay uh, in other regards. The print came out quite okay. Uh, the maker coin printed without any issues. It's maybe difficult to see uh, because it's so white, uh, but uh, the details in the text came out quite well and, and uh, I didn't have any special issues with this. Uh, I printed out this test print. Uh, and uh, bridging for ABS uh, was okay. There was a slight overhang issues, but uh, the overhang tests came out quite okay, and uh, the details in the print uh, are good. And I think it's uh, it's rather strong uh, filament or material. It's difficult to cut cut it, and it's. It's uh, tough like ABS, so it's a very strong filament. I, I printed out a Benchy, but uh, the, the print came loose on the bed at this height, so it uh, failed. But uh, uh, other, beside the, it came loose. Uh, the quality of the print is, is quite good, so it's uh, uh, pretty pretty good. Um, it didn't come to the overhangs, it felt before that, so I can just that. And I printed this uh, Minecraft sword, uh, it was f like this on the bed. Um, um, as you can see, it uh, has quite some warping to it, it's a long flat print, uh, but uh, the edges are clean and uh, and the print finished, uh, even though it did have some serious warpness to it uh, towards the end here. But uh, uh, I printed this with very little infill, just 5% I think, uh, just to test the bed uh, adhesion on if it would warp severely. This model didn't warp uh, at all, this was just quite good uh, bed adhesion uh, stuck to the bed and also the maker coin. Was uh, was not a problem with with warping, so I'm I'm quite happy with this filament, and I think it has good applications, and it's easy to print with, and it's very strong filament. One thing I noticed with the filament, it recommended to printing at 270 to 290 degrees, and 110 to 140 on the bed, so it's uh, printing at very high temperature. Uh, uh, I printed that 100 degrees on the bed and, and 290 and, and this was the results I got. Uh, I didn't want to go higher on the bed because I've got uh, thermal runaway errors if I go over 100 degrees on the Prusa. So, uh, but at 100 degrees it, it printed fine. So this is the packets it, it came with and it's a I would recommend this for uh, ABS uh, material because it was very easy to work with. So the next filament I had was the Polymax PLA and this uh, printed at normal PLA temperature. Uh, I printed at 200 degrees for this one and this uh, probably is the most favorable uh, filament I have tested to so far. It is a really tough filament and uh, prints very easily. Uh, I printed a temperature tower test uh, of the broken pieces, uh, but uh, I printed from 210 degrees to 170 degrees and 
I just broke it in half to see how strong it is. It was very difficult to break it apart. And, uh, and then printed this test piece. Uh, the overhangs uh, came out really good. There was no uh, issues with the steepest overhang. It is just perfect. And the column here is very good. And uh, bridging was very clean. Um, uh, just everything about this print was uh, spot on, so this is very very uh, clean print and uh, it's very very tough filament, it's uh, difficult to break it, it, it bends a little bit more than uh, normal PLA I would say, so uh, it's a good, uh, good strength uh, characteristic in it and I printed uh, Thor's hammer uh, and, and a little bit bigger one. I thought uh, because my channel is small, I would be a good idea to have a small band hammer uh, on hand <laughs> if I do a live stream and have some issues. So this is gonna be my band hammer for now when I'm a small channel. So I think this is uh, very funny. Uh, it bends uh, and this very very strong material, and, and this one. It's, it's also it flexes uh, quite some bit, so this is uh, very very tough material and, and it's super strong material. And the layer adhesion is is uh, is excellent. You have difficult time uh, separating the layers, and I can't even break this apart. Uh, so it's it's very strong here. Uh, this was at 175 degrees. Uh, break point so uh, this is well below the recommended printing temperature and still it was quite difficult to break it apart so um, and the print quality on those tests it's just excellent print quality so I think this is uh, probably the, my favorite filament uh, I've tested so far so I'm really happy with this filament so this will be this video on, on Polymax PLA from Polymaker and high temperature polycarbonate ABS alloy from Protopasta. I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, find, found it uh, useful uh, to see what those filaments uh, are working, how they are working for me. So I uh, thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one.